Hey guys, how's everyone doing? Oh, what up, Photons? Thank you so much for popping in and saying hi and for the lurk. I really appreciate it. How are we doing? How's everyone doing tonight? I hope you're doing well. So tonight is our gemstone designing stream. We haven't done one of these in a little bit, so I'm kind of excited. Don't know what we're going to do. I think we're going to start with uh, the Doctor Strange logo tonight um or, or the the doctor strange um um infinity stone if you know what i mean so uh i think we're gonna we're gonna do that and see uh what we can what we can do from there all right um so uh yeah how about we uh hop on over here to our gem cad hey guys Man, what a day today. You know what I'm saying? I was just putzing around with it this uh, a little bit. Just making some random, random thing. But yeah, alright. So, uh, anyway. Uh, let's see here. The, uh... This. This is what we're gonna make. All right, we're gonna go ahead and save. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and um, go here. We're gonna save image as my uh, my desktop because I was dumb and uh, forgot to do this. There we go. Cool. All right. So uh, yeah, let's start with uh, Doctor Strange's Infinity Stone, shall we? Let me just uh, pull up an image here for the, uh, where is it right there? Okay, properties, desktop, there we go, cool, done. All right, let's see what we can do. All right, so clearly, if we take a look at that, that's like, it's kind of like a marquee style. So let's, let's change our ratios here. Uh, we need length to be two. And, uh, okay. And then we're going to go ahead and change our material to, uh, we're going to do that. And then we need to be green. Right? Yes. And actually, this will this would make a great tourmaline. We're totally doing a green tourmaline. I dig it. All right, let's do it. Oh, that's kind of neat, actually. Oh, the five symmetry looks great. What does three look like here? Maybe. Okay. Okay. What if... Okay, so this clearly looks like an eye, right? Or supposed to. Okay, let's, let's just go ahead and blow that up a little bit. Zoom in on that on my screen. Okay. Okay, I got this. Here we go. Alright, so we're going to have to go like this. Seventy-eight. 
Yeah, what up, Nyx? How are you doing tonight? Yeah, this is... <laughs> this program is called Gem Cut Studio, dude. And uh, you can you can create gemstone designs on it. All right, so we're gonna go ahead and go 18. Have I been muted this whole time? Test, 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 test. I thought I'd been talking. Oh my god, how embarrassing. Hey guys, how's everyone doing tonight? Thanks for joining. Thanks, Protons. Hey, John. Oh, just now. Okay, cool. Um, so, so let me explain to you um, how this works. So, there we go. Uh, up top here is the gear, the gear that, that you can move uh, that selects the different facets. Um, and then down here is the angle, so that's the angle that the stone is before it touches the lap. Um, and then obviously depth is, is how far in you cut. So uh, what we're trying to do right now, if you take a look at the picture um, over, over here, um, we are trying to make the infinity stone that's in Doctor Strange's pendant. I think I think that would be a lot of fun. So we're gonna go ahead and put this to 72. Because if you look here, 72 is right here. And then we're gonna mirror it. And what this does, if you take a look here, it changes where our cuts enter. You see that? So this actually kind of has a. Like that. We're gonna go ahead and cut. But then I think it, it's it's a little more round, isn't it? Kinda like that. Then we're going to do one more. We're going to do one more. There we go. I think that looks good. But we're doing this for a tourmaline. Okay, so what would Doctor Strange's stone look like, right? You have your first job and you've been working there for one and a half months. Oh yeah, John is is a uh, a, a chef, an apprentice chef, right? Whoa, look at that. That's cool. What is the most interesting thing you've learned so far, John? Ooh, look at that! I like that. How to make 
Béarnaise and Hollandaise sauces. Oh, I love Hollandaise sauce, dude. Hollandaise sauce is the best. Oh, what up, Val? How are you doing tonight? Thanks for joining. Tonight we are designing gemstones inspired by nerdy things. And right now we are doing uh, Doctor Strange's um, Infinity Stone. How are you doing tonight, Val? Ryan, I should play Among Us with Val one day? Okay. I still haven't played... Okay, I played it once. I played it once, and everyone was immediately like, It's Ryan! <laughs> and I'm like, wait, no! And they're like, yep, sorry, man. And then they're like, oh, I guess it wasn't Ryan. Steam, oh, Steam played with you for the first time the other day. How was that? What up, Doug? How are you doing tonight, dude? Yeah, so we're trying to make the Infinity Stone uh, for Doctor Strange. And, uh, you know, it's kind of like an eye, so we're going to do that. Oh, look at that. You kind of get like an X in there. So right now we're working on the bottom of the stone. You should host a noob night. Yes. I'd totally do it, dude. I'd stream that. Ooh. So this is how we come up with our cuts, by the way. Um, is just sit here and putz around with this kind of stuff. Now, if you take a look here, down here is the rendering. Um, so this, this kind of shows you how the light is going to reflect in the gemstone. And, uh, it's, it's actually pretty darn accurate, too. Yeah, you deserve a shout-out, dude. Thank you for your support, Val. Everyone go check out Val. Toss a follow. Yeah, I like this cut a lot too so far. Now, what I'm trying to look at are these are these corners here, right? The edges, because that, that's these facets. Now, watch, watch how they change. All right, watch how the, those edges change as I change the angle on the facet. Okay. So we don't want this to happen. We don't want this. We don't want to see the background color. Kind of um, here. Hold on. Let me show you. You see how this background color here? You see how it disappears? That's light. That it, the light is bouncing. Yep, exactly. No windows. The light is bouncing in and then out of the bottom of the stone. So we want something like that. Look at that deep color. I like that. All right, let's see what happens if I put something here. Yo, what up, Yar? How are you doing? Thanks for joining. Ooh, does this actually give it an eye look? Ooh, I kind of like that. What do you guys think of that? We haven't even done anything to the top of the stone yet, but look at that. That's that's kind of cool. Here, should I should I show you the 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 bigger picture? Isn't 
It's going well. Yeah, what a valley. That does help with the eye look. I agree. Now, the question is, do we want it to be... No, I think I like this. This also uh, makes it look nice because... See these meet points right here? See? It meets with those right there. Right there. Cut. Ooh, that's a nice looking bottom. How you doing tonight, Valley? <coughs> Thanks for joining, man. I really appreciate it. So we're designing this cut for a tourmaline because tourmalines have a really good green. And um, I love tourmaline. Good, I'm glad you're doing well. I don't think we need to add anything else to the bottom here. I think that's actually pretty good. So let's go to the top. Now, let's... We go to 72. Yo, what up, Zid? Nice to see all these lovely facets here tonight. Yes! How you doing tonight, Zid? I've been doing well, Valley. Thank you for asking. All right, so we're gonna put this to, uh, what is this? This is, okay, so we're gonna do this to 51 and 93. And then we can cut, ooh. Reminds you of a less complex Pharaoh's eye, yeah. All right, Val. Thanks, blah, 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 blah. My, my lips just decided they didn't know what to do right there. Okay, so now we gotta change this angle a little bit here. So this is actually gonna come down to be about right here. Okay, and now we're gonna change this angle up. Ooh, look at that. Ooh! So again, the rendering down low here um, is, is how the light's gonna reflect in the stone. That's a nice looking, ooh, I'm liking that. And what we're trying to do is, um, oh, we got to take that deeper. We're trying to um, make the Infinity Stone that Doctor Strange has. Like, what would it look like if it, if we actually had the faceted Doctor Strange Stone, right? So if you take a look here, here I'm gonna make it nice and big so you can see it. See, see how how it's kind of like a like a well like an eye shape. So that's what we're kind of doing with this we're trying to make the stone look like an eye but not like every other eye we see right so okay so here's what we're gonna do i'm gonna add a meat point to like here and so then we can adjust the angle how we want yo you looked away for two seconds, came back to see this magic. <laughs> so I think I want this like... I think I want it like... That. I think that's good right there. Ryan, you just ordered your new gaming PC and you'll have the graphics to run ray tracing software like your gem program. Yeah, dude! You're playing with digital rocks. Yes! So, um... So, when I showed you the parts on on my, my machine, right? So, for example, here. Let me, let me run you through the, the machine real quick. Real quick, okay? Pardon the ugly picture here. So hop on over here, okay? So remember we have this dial here. This dial's got the numbers and this is what affects the, the stone's facets, right? Because it, it can turn it, right? 
And then we've got over here, we've got the angle that this arm is at, okay? Uh, upon, like, at a resting position. So, translating that to the, to the software here, if you look up top here, right up here where my mouse is, right above the picture and the rendering, or not the rendering, the, uh, the, this part, this is the gear wheel. Okay, so all the numbers go from 1 to 96, right? And this is what turns your stuff. Um, and then, over here is your angle, so the, the way the arm goes. And then the rest is just symmetry. So right now I've got two symmetry, so what it does is it mirrors it on both sides. Whereas if I do three, it mirrors it three ways, or four ways. You see? And you can go, you can just go keep going. You can even do just one and go, go asymmetrical on us. Wait, where was I? 51. There we go. Yeah. All right, so cut. All right, so we want to make this look like an eye but we don't want it to be like uh, like a, a generic eye. All right, so now we're gonna go to 57. So if we do that, do I know which piece of tourmaline? Nope, no idea. I just know a green one. <laughs> This is 96, right? So we're gonna go like that. Take this to 96. Okay, what what's going on here? Hold on. That actually kind of gives it a really cool effect. See what happens when we when we put a table on. Does the glow in the reference photo see seem to be uh, rotationally translated in comparison to the overall gem shape? Does the cross on the bottom have to line up with the cross on the top? Nope, does not have to line up with the cross on the top. Nope, that's just how I designed it. So, like, for example, I actually... That kind of looks really cool. Okay. Um, so, for example, these... Let's see, I could go edit, and I could be... We could mirror it like this. See, we could actually make it a little wider. The reason why they are mirrored like that is so that I have meat points. So what you want, rather, you don't have to have it. So for example, um, okay, that, that looks cool. Here, let me show you guys. What do you think of that?
That's kind of neat. Yeah, and then we lose any windowing there. It's really chaotic on the edges, but it's nice and smooth in the center. That's really interesting, isn't it? Um, so let me let me give you an example here. All right, save. What is this stone called? What's this infinity stone called? It's just called green infinity stone. <laughs> Time stone, infinity time stone, perfect. You need to type slower tonight, you're missing letters. This is what I get for him. <laughs> what a bottom of time. How are you doing tonight, dude? Thanks for joining. We just, um, we just finished up Dr. Strange's uh, infinity stone here. What do you, uh, what do you think? The Eye of uh, got something. But we can always rename it, I suppose. But, okay, so to answer your question, Zid, if I understand correctly. So let me open one. Um, I made one that's called Chaotic Neutral, okay? So so this one uh, kind of looks like the stone. Um, yeah, let me just hide that. Uh, this one, nothing mirrors like each other on this stone right it's all just like chaos but it still looks really really cool doesn't it so it doesn't have to mirror it at all as a matter of fact when you don't mirror things uh for example if we take um i think it's this one if we take this one and uh, let me just go here and delete that. And you take a look at that. You see how it looks all pixelated? Isn't that cool? Um, and what that is, is just a really simple top and just a bottom. And uh, you see how this line here is not mirrored at all up here. As a matter of fact, it's crossed by this one, right? So, no, you can do whatever you want. All right, should we do should we do another gemstone? Which one? What what should we do? Oh, whoops. Probably just do a uh, yellow background. Um, what are the, uh, what, what are the other infinity stones? Let's see, um, uh, oh, look at that. Wow, okay. Why didn't I just grab this one to begin with? Alright, let's do some infinity stones. Yeah, you guys up for it? Let's do it. The Tesseract? But that's just a square. I mean... That is true. So here, here, let's do this. Uh, boom. All right, check this out. So here's all the infinity stones, right? Now. Oh yeah. Look up the Infinity Gauntlet. What up, El Chow? Thank you so much for hopping in. I really appreciate it. How are you doing tonight, El Chow?
Oh, none of them, they're, none of them are faceted on that gauntlet. That's all right. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. I'm going to open this so I can see it better. You're sleepy but doing well? Well, good. All right, so let's do the power stone, huh? Why not? So obviously they just look like lumps, right? So, okay, power stone. What, what would make a good power stone shape? Um, like what's a powerful shape? You know what's a really strong shape? Triangles. And I do love me some triangles. But let's do something a little different. Whoa, that's insane, John. It just looked like they were cabochons in the gauntlet when I saw it. Whoa! Dude, Zid! Thank you so much, man! I really appreciate that! Hey, check it out, guys. We just got some K-pop. Yeah, look at those K-pop emotes. Oh, yeah, by the way, if you cheer or subscribe, uh, we uh, you get to share K-pop emotes for the month of K-pop. <laughs> What if we go crazy with this? Okay. Oh, ho, ho, ho. guys, I have an idea. Okay, what, what if we try and make this kind of... Yeah, what up, Metallic? How are you doing tonight? Dude, I, I really appreciate that. Thank you so much for the cheers, Zid. Okay, 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 okay. I got this. I got this. What if... What if we try and make this... We're just gonna we're just gonna go kind of oh, crazy. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much, photons. I really appreciate that, dude. I'm doing well. Okay. So where where are we going? We're going. I was trying to make it look like. Like a twisted, like... Oh yeah, guys, if we complete a level 5 hype train... Um, I will give away a gemstone. Okay, how can we... Okay, okay, okay. We gotta reset this. We gotta, like... We gotta, like... Delete that. Okay, now we, we got something crazy going on right now. File new! And we're gonna do... We're doing Amethyst here. Okay. Brian gonna feel the meme I posted in the Discord on a spiritual level. Thank you. Alright, so, so the Power Stone, right? The Purple Power Stone. I, th I imagine it as a as a a triangle because triangle is a very powerful shape right triangle can support a lot so we're gonna go ahead and i want but i want to try and make this triangle look like look like it's it's curving yeah thank you metallic all right guys if we complete a level five hype train i will give away a gemstone who wants to win a gemstone so to give you an idea of a of something that you have the possibility of winning what I do is I facet gemstones such as this and um, when we if we complete a level 5 hype train um, anyone in chat and around in and around chat no cam we just started the hype train guy um, if you're in chat, you qualify for a chance to win a finished 
gemstone. Oh, Whoa! Yeah. Thank you so much, Valley Forge. Thank you, dude. Oh my god. Thank you. Yes. Oh yeah. Oh my gosh. Dude, I really appreciate that, man. Now, look at this. I can't even find my gem oh, cat anymore right yeah. now. Good evening, Scott. How are you doing tonight? Oh, my gosh. All right, guys. We're at level two. Oh, dude. We're almost done with level two. If we complete level five, oh, yeah. we're giving away a gemstone. Who wants to win a gemstone tonight? Huh? Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. What up, cute jeweler? Oh. Guys, we're in the middle of a raid train. What up, Cloud? How you doing, dude? Thank you so much, Redberry. What up, Shad? Oh, thank you, Melody. By the way, guys, if we complete a level five hype train, I'm giving away a gemstone tonight. Who wants to win a potential? I mean, you will win a gemstone. And uh, to give you an idea, these are the kind of gemstones that I facet. Yeah! What are you, What up, Alistair? Thank you, Corinne! Thanks, Mirror Mask! Guys, we're at level 3 hype train! Yeah! 45%! Let's do it! Who wants to win a gemstone tonight? Yeah! Oh, yeah! Let's do it! Let's do it, guys! We got this! We got this! Who's gonna win? Who's winning oh, it tonight? Yeah. Yeah. Level three complete. Oh man, guys, we're so close to level five. Yeah, Mir. Yeah, thank you so much, treasures. Fifty percent, fifty-one percent. Thank you, Metallic. Oh my gosh. Thank you, Automaton, and Aries, and John, and Jeweler. Oh, man, we're so close. 67%. Thank you so much, Alice. 67, 69%. <laughs> Four minutes left to get to level five, and then we got to complete level five. Guys, we're so close. Yeah, thank you so much, Sid. Thank you, Blaze. Oh, man. Guys. We what up, person in the mirror? How you doing tonight, dude? Oh man, look at all these K-pop emotes! Thank you so much, mirror mask. Yeah. All right, where are we at? 10, 11, 37 percent up to level five. Guys, can we complete level five? If we complete it, I'm giving away a gemstone. Who wants to win a gemstone? And if you're in chat, you qualify to win. Yeah, 44%. Thank you, Automaton. Yeah, let's do it, guys. We're so close. We are so close. Let's get it. Let's get it. Good evening, Tim. How are you doing, dude? Oh, thank you so much, Valley Forge. 89%. What up, kid? Thank you so much, Cloud. Yeah, Raspberry. Thanks for the follow, kid. I really appreciate it. Guys, we just completed level five hype train. Oh, man. Yeah, thank you so much, Alice. Oh, my God. 109%. Thank you guys so much for your generosity. Yeah, cute jeweler. Thank you, dude. Oh, I really appreciate that, man. Thank you so much for the follow, treasures. And for the support. Oh, my gosh. Guys, can we get some hype in chat here? This That was amazing. Okay. Okay. Who wants to win a gemstone? Show me some hype in chat for who, who wants to win. Who's winning tonight? All right, guys, you do have to be present in the chat oh, to win. Yeah. 
All right, let's do it. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. How you doing tonight, Cloud Dish? What up, Dragon? Thank you guys so much for joining and for all of your support. I really, really oh, appreciate it. Yeah. All right, so while we are doing that, let's get back to uh, some designs, shall we? So what we're doing tonight is we're designing oh, yeah. Infinity Stones. Um, and uh, we're working on the Power Stone, the purple one at the moment. And I want to kind of... So I was thinking, like, oh, what shape? Yeah. What up, chemist? How are you doing tonight, dude? Thanks for joining. So I was thinking, like, what shape would the the power stone be if it were a fascinated oh, gemstone? Oh, yeah. And I'm thinking a triangle because a triangle is a very uh, strong shape, right? So what I want to try and do, though, is make this triangle look like it's kind of curved, which is going to be a little hard. Yeah, what up, demon? You're some flower sizing for your warp threads for your next weaving attempt. Oh man, a cushion cut? I think I think a triangle. So so let's come in here. So I want to kind of make it look kind of curved. You know what I mean? Like that. Should I have like kind of more, less of a curve, or sh like, like that? Do you think that's a, that's good, like that? I kind of like that actually. Okay, let's do this. Let's do this. Also, hi, hi. Gradual changes over three to four facets. Wow, look at that. Look at that, that rendering already looks cool. Yeah, me too, Jeweler. Thank you everyone so much. It almost looks corrupted. <coughs> Oh man, thank you guys so much for all of your support. Oh, During yeah. the hype train, I really appreciate it. 25 subs, 5200 bits. Guys, you are the best. Thank you so much. So how long have I been going and how much more? Um, we've, we've only been on for an hour. We're going to be on for two more hours. That was some sick timing. No clue that was going to work out so well. Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, Tim. Yeah, what up, Al? How are you doing tonight, dude? So, okay, guys. So, as you're watching uh, the design process here, um, if you take a look at the at the the down here this is kind of the rendering this is going to show you the light oh man yar all right thank you so much jeweler i really appreciate it dude oh yeah oh we might end up doing a sand dollar tonight oh thank you so much mirror Uh, we might be, we might, yeah, I think we're going to try and make all the Infinity Stones tonight. Also, you've been wondering, what software does your profession use? Uh, so, I use Gem Cut Studio, which, by the way, guys, if you go to Gem Cut Studio, you can get a free 30-day trial and uh, test it out. See, oh, see if you like it. Yeah. Oh, my God, they're still going. They're still going. <laughs> you won't be able to stay on the whole time, but this has been a really cool learning experience and and the hype oh yeah well what do you guys say should we pick a winner should we pick a winner oh yeah all 
right, let's do it. All right, all right, guys, remember, you do have to be present in chat in order to, uh, in order to win. Oh, thank you so much, person. That's good to know. All right, guys, so we got Al... Uh, these are the people oh, entered. We got Alistair, yeah. Alice, Zid, Blaze, Yar, Metallic, Demon, Cute Jeweler, Photons, Raspberry, Person in the Mirror, Aries, Shad, Mirror Mask, Damned Kid, oh, John yeah. Dahl, El Chow, Valley Forge, Nyx, From Gods, Tim, Melody Treasure, Scott, Recovering Chemist, Doug Daddy, Al, and Uncreative Automaton. Oh, all right, guys, closing entries now. Okay. Also, unless it can do way more oh, complex stuff like yeah. multi polygonal polygonal shapes, I mean, you can do like a 3D like as long as there's flat facets, you can do it. Right? Oh yeah. Yes, Alistair, you are in. All right, the entries are closed. Let's see. Oh, yeah. I know, the hype train's still going. All right, guys, so let's see here. Let's see here. Uh, gem final. Okay, so I don't, I don't have a finished piece at the moment to give away. However, uh, I will put up some rough, and you get to pick which one you want all right let's do it let's do it okay oh my gosh still going it's still going so let's see what i got here what do i have here i have Oh, yeah. All right, where's my box? I gotta grab my box. Found it. Anything blue? I'll put something blue up there. Quick, start another one before this one ends. It is a never-ending train. That's insane. Okay, how about this? How about this? Ooh, okay. 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 Oh, Oh, yeah. my gosh. It's still going. You guys just get to watch it all night long. All night. Okay. First thing. I've got some Ametrine. Ametrine is is both amethyst and citrine and uh which means that the iron inside the amethyst actually um oxidized and turned yellow into citrine all right what else i got what else i got um let's see something blue you say How about we do... Something blue, something blue, something blue. Um... I have... Man, do I not have anything, like, blue? Let's take a look. Oh, okay, so you have an option of this. I'll give you an option of, um, oh, where's it at? Here we go. This is, uh, fluorite. Um, and then... Oh, 
Oh, I got you. Okay. Okay, I'll give you something kind of like a greenish blue. This one's partially faceted, so... This will give you an idea of what it'll look like. And then we have... Oh my gosh, sorry, camera. Camera's getting blurry. And then we have Amazon Night. This is what it looks like when it's faceted. So, if you win, you get your choice of Amazon Night. Um, 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 fluorite or, oh my gosh, where'd I set it? Where'd I set it down? Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, thank you so much, Tink. I really appreciate that, dude. Thank you so much for the four month recommitment. I really appreciate that, dude. All right. So we got fluorite, Amazon. I, oh my gosh. What was the first one I put up? Why can't I remember? Oh yeah. Some amitrine. Thank you. How are you doing tonight, Tink? Perfect, Zid. All right, you guys ready? Did I change the hype train cooldown? No, it should be three hours. Yeah, hype train's three hours. All right, guys, show me some hype in chat. And then we're going to pick and then we're going to pick a winner. All right. Yeah, there we go. There we go. Give me the show me. Show me some of those K-pop. Some of your new your new K-pop stuff here. Ooh, so cute. Yeah. All right. Here we go. You guys ready? All right, three, two, one. 42 photons! Congratulations, photons! Dude, photons! Photons, you just won a gemstone, dude. Congratulations. All right, Photons. Now everyone wants to know which one. Which one are you going to pick? The Amitrine, the Fluorite, or the Amazonite? That's more of the color than it is. My exposure's a little high. Gonna have to go with the Amitrine. Aw, oh, yeah, Photons. Good choice, good choice. Sweet! Congratulations, 42 photons! Alright guys, should we get back to our infinity stones? Let's do it! Thank you so much for your support, I really appreciate it! Also, if you're enjoying yourself tonight, consider pressing that follow button. Um, and hang out with us because I also do gem cutting. All right, Forged. Valley Forged, you have a good night, dude. Thank you so much for hanging out. I really appreciate all of your support. All right, so 
so we're making infinity stones right and um what we're what we're trying to make here is the power stone the purple one right all right el chow you have a good night dude always a pleasure yeah all right so so i want to do a triangle but i want it to kind of look like it's twisting so that's what we're doing now um i do want to i want to pull this up and see where am i okay so i'm cutting this that facet or i can facet these this side here Have a good night, John. Thank you so much for hanging out, man. I really appreciate it. There we go. Look at that. That that actually looks pretty cool. All right, we're gonna cut that. Yeah, it is an interesting cut, isn't it? it it's it looks chaotic, doesn't it? So like, if you take a look at the at this, it looks kind of chaotic, but it's really it's really interesting, isn't it? I'm gonna see if I can put if I can put like a little like three star thing. In here. No. See that it just it just takes all the light away. You're gonna try and make a connection to power and madness, but can come up with something good. I mean, uh, that makes sense. Here we go. Actually, I wonder if I can connect this to here somehow. All right, let's see if we can. Certainly can't. That's fine. We don't need that. I kind of like that. What do you guys think? Maybe... I mean, we can add, like, a little facet here. Let's see if that actually does anything, though. That's the biggest thing. Like, you can add the stuff, the facets and stuff. But you gotta ask yourself, does this do anything for the stone? Because if it doesn't actually, like, do anything for the stone... So, like, if you guys take a look here... You see this right here? This is the facet we just added, right? And... I really like that pinwheel look, too. However, you see this? It, does, it, it takes away from the stone. So, if we can see this background color through the stone, that means we're losing light. We don't want to lose light. As cool as it looks, it's not doing anything or adding to the effect of the stone. Oh, pardon me, I just burped. So... As, as fun as that looks, it's not going to do anything for us.
What if there was something unpolished on the bottom, like the Eye of the Zeus? Okay, okay, Let, let's see if we can do something like that. Uh, how about right here? But not that big, I don't want it that big. Okay, okay, then what if we, what if we put something in the center here to kind of connect those, right? Let's just make it really, like, small, okay? Cut, and then if we frost those... Did it do anything? No, I don't think so. We still lose that right there. Let's keep it for now. Let's see. Let's see what it looks like when we move to the top, to the top of the stone. Okay, so now we're going to the top of the stone here. Um, okay, and this is symmetry three ninety six. Yeah, you like it? I'm glad. Whoa, look at that! That's cool. <laughs> oh, look at that, you look into it, it is like madness. You're losing your mind. That's cool. Yeah, coming up with ideas and stuff for the designs is a lot of fun. Also, you try looking for an answer, if I could, let's say a fireball, and it seems I can't. Cam, I'm camcorder. I'm trying to, I'm trying to understand what you're saying, but I, I, I can't understand. What up, Fox? Thanks for joining, dude. How have you been? So my guy I follow on YouTube is about to be doing a huge gaw. Is that? He's giving away an Amazonite Apache Tears. Ooh, I love Apache Tears. Those are fun to facet. Unsearched uh, pay dirt for diamonds and nice huge crystal like you gave Ryan and some more things. Yeah, that's awesome, dude. Diamond Miner Ivins. Is that I-V-I-N-S? Yep, you're busted, Fox. It's been too long. How have you been, dude? Alright, we're gonna go ahead and cut that. I kinda like that look. Okay, cut. Now we gotta go here, which is 27. Oh, yes, camcorder, I think, yes. As long, you can't do curves. It has to be flat facets. You can't have anything curving or folding in on itself because the machine is incapable of doing that. Ooh, now it's gone.
Oh, my bad, camcorder. Oh, <laughs> look at that, guys! Ooh, that's a badass looking stone. Look at this. Actually, that that frosted part on the bottom. Look at look at what that did. It made like a like a three prong thing. It does. It really does. I like that. Okay, okay, so we're gonna go ahead and, and cut that. Now, let's see what it looks like with a table. I think it's gonna look bad, but let's see. What do you think of that? That's actually not bad. But then this part here... That's trippy. All right, all right, let's see what it, I'm gonna go ahead and cut that. Let's see what it looks like if we just delete this. Okay, that looks better with that deleted. What do you guys think of that? At one degree, Yar, I am not faceting something at one degree. Okay, but let's see what it looks like. It doesn't actually do anything. Okay, we'll keep it flat. I, I like that. What do you guys think of that for the power, the infinity power stun? All right, all right. Oh, whoops. Sorry, 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 sorry. There you go. Couldn't see it. Uh, yeah, probably photons. <laughs> All right, so we have a little uh, optimizer here. That we can... Oh, here, let me just uh, hide that. I think this one looks the best. <coughs> oh, dude, look at how chaotic that was. Oh, that's so cool. That's that's so cool. I like that a lot. Now, from a jeweler's perspective, a goldsmith's perspective, you gotta look at it and you gotta say, okay, how difficult is this going to be to set in in a in a piece of jewelry? Because look, it, it's pretty well. It's chaotic. So what you got to look at is the corner here, right? Because this, this is uneven. So let's see if we can even that up, okay? Well, the girdle. So the girdle over here doesn't matter because prongs aren't going to go over that. Doesn't matter. What matters are these parts here, the, the points here, here, <gasps> sorry, here, here, here. And then what you got to do is you got to look at the girdle or this part here and how that goes in. Because when you set a stone like this into a piece of jewelry, um, 
So you have your prong, and what you have to do is you take a ball burr, which is exactly what it sounds like. It's just a ball that cuts, and you have to cut a pocket inside there so that this corner, so that the tip doesn't touch any metal, because if that tip touches any metal, it chips. And then what you got to do is you got to cut out um, a little bit horizontally and vertically to make up for this part of the stout here and for and for this part of the stone right here does that make sense so then when you pull the prong over um you're you're putting pressure on the stone but you're not putting pressure on that corner can we cut the top of the rough facet back to even it out so the top is actually evened out here and here because you see how the how these meet right here so we got to even it out down here is where where we gotta where we gotta even it out. So let's go back down here to our pavilion. All right, what can we do here? Is this doing anything? Yes, that lightens up the stone a lot. So what if we oh um, edit? What if we mirror it? Cancel. Okay. So we got to put another facet here, basically, to to not have a jeweler, including myself, because I am a jeweler, a <laughs> goldsmith, um, yelling at us. So let's go ahead and add a meet point here. Let's see if we can if we can accomplish something. So that evens that out actually a bit, which is which is nice. Wow, look at that! Dude, did we just make it better? <laughs> That's crazy. I mean, we really brightened it up. I think we just made this stone look a lot better just by doing that. Yes! We just Bob Ross the shit out of this thing. Cut. Oh, what up, Bethany? How are you doing tonight, dude? Alright, so we're gonna save... Okay, okay, okay. Okay, we'll save this. Um, what's it called? What, what is this Infinity Stone called? This is the power one, right? Power stone. Power stone, okay. Yeah, there is, there is a little pinwheel in the center. Oh, that's so cool. You think we should call it trigonometry? That's clever. I like that. All right. All right. I got... Well, now I got to edit this one, okay? Let's see if we can even this out with that real quick. We're just going to see. We're going to see. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Yeah, this one actually looks really, really cool. 
Dude, look, look at these look at these three points in the center here. The only problem is we got some windowing. You see all these? All these light spots here? That's windows. So if we cancel it, I guess we still had some windows here. And we still have those, but it's lighter. <laughs> Thanks, photons. Classic. All right, so I'm gonna I'm gonna cut this, and we're gonna see what happens when I frost it. No, it does not look good. I actually kind of like this a bit better. So let's do this, and let's do let's do this. Let's see if we can get rid of some of those some of those dark spots. However, if you think about it, the dark spots do make sense. Cause it is the power stone. I can I like that. I like it. What do you guys think? What's the top row, third one in? Oh, sorry, here. This one? So I don't even look at the graph, I just look at the picture. <laughs> so like, if you look right here, right right here, can you guys see my mouse? Use my mouse. Right here. Watch this, watch this reflection right here on the stone, okay? Right here. When we go to here, you see how that got darker? But what it does, if you take a look at it, is it eliminates a little bit of the extinction. Extinctions when you see the black. I am drinking straight out of a... Yeah, straight out of the teapot. That's how we get moist around here. Clearly it's my shiny head that just blinds you. Well, I think we're going to keep this, actually. I really like this. Save. Alright, should we see what it looks like in some different materials? Oh! By the way, for those of you joining us, we also did the, um, um, um... Uh, before this, we did the Time Stone. Do you guys want to see what the Time Stone... <laughs> Aries. All right, so we did the we did the time stone. Check it. What do you guys think of that? This is designed to be cut into a tourmaline. Yeah, you like that, guys? Oh, brilliant photons. Why didn't I think of that? Um. I do like the time stone, too. I'm excited to, to cut that. And then we have our, our power stone here, right? Ooh, that looks good. I like the dark in the stone. I think the dark actually adds quite a bit to it. Oh, dude. Okay, okay, okay. All right, so you see this and this? These go, these kinda go together. So what if we put these 
going the opposite direction. Let's try that. Edit. What do you guys think of that? Oh, that's even better! It's even better! Oh my god. Isn't that insane? Like, if, when you, it's just a matter of, of switching this facet from this side to this side. It does lose some of the darkness. And, and it's no longer, this is no longer even. So we actually have to add one more facet. So let's do that, okay? Okay. Er, okay, okay, guys. Okay, hold on. Let's, let's just try this out real quick. Okay, it's impossible. Okay, 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 okay. So anyway, <laughs> file open. We're just going to make sure. Okay, cool. Okay, so do we want to see what it looks like in some other... Do we want to look at uh, what it looks like in some other things? Like, uh, how about an emerald? Aquamarine. Ooh, it looks kind of good in aquamarine. If you could set Doctor Strange's time stone in gold with the setting, it would be... Yeah, Bethany! That's what we have the cute jeweler for. She would do that. How about tourmaline? Uh, Peridot? Peridot's nice looking. This looks good. Uh, tanzanite. It's a nice looking tanzanite. You'd never be able to afford it, but... One day, Bethany. One day. All right. All right, let's see how it looks in the Pyrope Garnet. Almost nothing looks good in the Pyrope Garnet. Okay, here we go. Okay, that looks that looks pretty good. That actually looks uh, pretty darn good. I must say. I must say. That, that looks pretty awesome. How hard is this stone to find? This is a rather simple stone to find, actually. How about Savorite? Ooh, I love me some Savorite Garnet. Hessonite? Hessonite's the, uh, or, uh, Sp Spessartine. I have some Spessartine Garnet. Have you guys ever seen an orange Garnet? It's really, really pretty, as you can see. Should we see what it looks like as a sapphire? It's a nice look of sapphire. What about something with multiple colors? Unfortunately, the program doesn't show something with multiple colors. And of course, everything looks good in a ruby. If you ever were to get a stone and cut for your hubby, this would be it. Aww, awesome. Zircon, zircons are amazing. Yeah, what would you set it in, metallic? Are right, you guys ready to see what it looks like as a diamond? That's actually not a bad diamond if we can fix that center. The only problem is the center here. 
Show mirror the X cubes? Okay, I can do that. Ooh, that's a nice looking power stone. All right. Uh, hoop, 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 hoop. All right. So we have uh, what are called X cube. I have half an X cube right here. I'll show you that one. So I don't have to go and find them all. So actually here, let me show you the one I'm fastening. Boom. Alright, Zid, see you in a bit. The deep red one, and I don't know. Yes, I need I need to complete it. I also gotta complete those giveaways too, man. Alright, alright, so we got we have our power stone done, right? All right. What's our next power stone going to be? So um, let's go ahead and toss this up here. So we've done the time stone and we've done the power stone. What should we do next? Space, mind, reality, or soul? I know, Fox. Ever since I went back to work... I'm working on it. I'm working on it. Let's see. Maybe we do... Should we do the, the space one? All right. You were the first one. All right. All right. Space is blue. So let's do... Let's do that. Yes. So we're going to go ahead and um, have it be a nice blue. Actually, guys, I have... Check it out. Look at that blue. Have a good night, Tim. Thank you so much for hanging out, dude. Yeah, so this would look awesome with that blue, wouldn't it? This is fusion drawn quartz. So it's quartz that they melt down and they add color to it. And then they fuse it all together and then they, they draw it out. That's why you can see the lines because they slowly pull it out. It looks incredibly edible to you. I've got a lot of it. That looks edible. All right. So let's do this. Witchcraft. All right. So, all right. So for the space stone, space stone, space stone. What shape would the space stone be? What shape is space? That's that's the question. Maybe we do... Maybe we do something crazy. Let's see if we can just come up with a crazy kind of shape. You think around? I guess there are a lot of round objects in space, aren't there? We do like a 12-sided round here. Give it some depth. Or 
oval. Yeah, maybe we should do an oval, like a nebula. Should we do that? I think I think I kind of like that idea. Galaxy shape. If you had the top, like the dragon eye thing, then frosted every other spiral, that'd be sick. Ooh. Frosted every other spiral, like, um... Oh, where's that one? Like... Like this one? Ha! <laughs> All right. Uh, oh yeah, we we gotta go file new. If you get a spiral inside with the facets, that would be awesome. All right. All right. Let's try it. Well, we can't do a spiral with with an oval. I don't think, or at least not very well. We could try. It. Let's try it. Why not? Let's just try it. Uh, excuse me. Thank you. Make it circular and stretch it a tad. Yes. Yep, 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 yep. Okay. Uh, so we gotta actually, we gotta go reset. And we're gonna go with this be like 1.5. Okay. All right, let's see let's see what we can do with this. But we got a spiral, right? Right, right, right. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, so let's start with these. Brian, you've got to head out for the night, but you... thank you so much, Photons. You have a wonderful night. And congratulations on winning tonight. You deserve it. All right. Man, how are we going to... We might have to spiral the top. Though I don't know how we're going to spiral. This is going to be hard, guys. I don't know if we can spiral. <laughs> Me too, Bethany.
Okay, okay, what do, ooh, ooh, what, okay, what if we do this? Okay. So this is, okay, so then we go one, two, three. Cut. One, 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 two, three. Oh, that just gets that just totally gets rid of that facet. Hmm, I don't know if we can do that. Your large window pane for the miniature dollhouse store is leaning over. <laughs> You'll get it. Let's just see where we can go with this. So far, this is... Okay. Okay. I gotta delete these. That would be a nightmare to facet. So, let's see here. What can we... How can we make this look kind of like a galaxy? So guys, what what does the space infinity stone actually do? Why is that overlapping? That's not a perfect meet. Oh my god. We need the tips to touch, please. Yeah, like did they ever show what the space one does in the movies? Because I can't for the life of me remember if they did. It's how Thanos teleports. So is that all it does then is just, just teleportation? Which, by the way, is the ultimate power, if you ask me. Ooh, look at that. That's kind of cool. See this, like, little ring? This little ring you got going around there? Space equals travel. Okay. But you create portals. Well, look at this. Portal! We just made a portal! This is meant to be, guys. This is meant to be. The Space Stone gives the user power over space. Anyone holding the Space Stone can create a portal from one part of the universe to another. In the Marvel films, the Space Stone is hidden inside a blue cube called the Tesseract. Ah, then we'll just make a big square. A big cube. That's what we'll do. 
Actually, I thought about that. Like, if I faceted um, 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 some of that uh, appetite that I have, that would totally look like the Tesseract, wouldn't it? Or from um, uh, Sword Art Online, the little teleport stones that teleport you back to town. Totally. I like the cube too, but I don't think we're going to be able to keep it. Do we like that? Uh, let me look here. Edit. Oh, whoops. Uh, cancel. I meant these ones. Edit. Do we like that or like, do we, uh, let me just add a meat point here. Uh, there. Or do we like, just make this kind of just small and pointless. Kind of like that. That might actually be better. 95. Alright, Aries. Okay, now we can do something really cool in the center here, okay? Well, we still have an oval uh, to, to an extent. It still kind of looks like a portal, but we do have to get rid of this square. Uh, because it's not desirable when looking into a gemstone and it doesn't add anything to it There are certain things you can do where uh, this kind of stuff will add to the design and the look uh, But in this case, I don't feel like it does Huh, maybe we can't do anything cool in the center here. That's just kind of boring. Yo, what up, Harry? How are you?
I was gonna say, look at that. This, oh, sorry guys, this was in the way. Uh, let's go ahead and get rid of that. Look at that, that kind of looks like you're you're looking through, like into a portal. So you got these like coming in. I kind of like that. All right, let's go to the crown. I'm doing well, thank you for asking. Look at that guy. It's so crazy. It's got a belly button. Let's just see what we get. Let's just putz with this, see what we get. Oh, sorry, Yar. A belly button is not something you normally loom for. <laughs> what you normally look for in a stone. <laughs> I mean, maybe. Okay, what? Oh no! Sorry, I don't mean to make you sleepy. Man, I've been up since 7 a.m. Or actually 5.30 a.m. this morning. And then I worked all day. That kind of looks like feathers, doesn't it? Kind of looks like feathery around the edges. Yo, what up, diamonds? How are you doing? Checking in for the night. Good night. Okay, have a good night. Thanks for hopping in. I appreciate it, dude. I hope you're doing well. Darn. Here we go. Why are yawns contagious? I think it's because of your mirror neurons. Your mere neurons tell you to uh, react and yawn. Hence why, like, when you smile at a baby, um, they smile back. It does look like feathers, doesn't it? I just don't like this big space in the center.
We're designing infinity stones tonight. How are you doing tonight, Sibis? I wonder what would happen if we could actually cut this to a point. What would that look like here? Because I just didn't cut it to a point. I don't know if there's a way I can do that. Oh man! Are you excited, Sibis? Have you used one before? I kind of like that, but I'm not. Hey, bud. But I, I, I like it, but I'm not in, like in, in, impressed by it. You know what I mean? Oh man, Sibis, are you nervous? I'd be so nervous and excited, full of anticipation. What up, Suki? How you doing, dude? Thanks for joining. Man, okay. So now I, I want to bring all this down to a point. Okay. How do we do that? Sibis, is there a quick way to, to bring this to a point? Or do I just gotta cut everything over again? So it goes deeper. How does one gift a sub without you being in the stream? So if everyone in the stream is subbed, then gifted subs will go to people who are followers. Add more facets? Well, but they, they'll still have that window. And I don't want that window. Well, dang it. <laughs> Alright, Zid. You have a wonderful night, dude. Thanks for hanging out. All right, all right. Well, we just gotta we gotta fix this somehow. Oh, I got it! I got it! I got it! Okay, edit. No, it wouldn't get rid of the window because it's got to be at like forty-one to forty-three degrees, and these angles are already at forty-one to forty-three degrees. Sometimes it still goes to others outside the stream, even if they're... Oh, really? I didn't know that. I know, Sibis. I thought I could do something cool at the center there, and I didn't even think about it. A continuous girdle! It's got a continuous girdle! Oh, it's because I'm, edit I'm editing. Okay. Look at that. Apply... All right, here we go. Edit. Um, we're gonna lose all of this. Okay, which ones can I edit first and not lose? Nope, we're just gonna do it. We're just gonna do it. Maybe we'll have a happy accident, right guys? Do it, Sib. It is a lot of fun.
Yeah, look at that. That's a good girdle line right there. We're good. We're good. We're all good. Okay. So this needs to go to 72. Yeah, I've tried I've tried Gemcad and this is way more user friendly. This program is a hundred dollars, but you can you can you can try it out uh, for a thirty day free trial. Uh, boom! You can hop over there and try it out thirty days. There, see how much better that middle looks. All right, let's 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 continue on with this. Cut. Yeah, Fox. Cut. Ooh. Kind of like that. This is like brilliant ovals to you. <laughs> Whoops. Yeah, Fox. See, we, we can bring this in. Sibis, that sounds terrible. And I'm sorry if you had to experience that. <laughs> I don't know. I kind of... I. A lot of people don't like the bow tie effect, but that kind of looks nice, I think. We'll just keep going. There, guys. Look at that gemstone. It is now invisible. But it's blue. There we go. We might go to right there. Doesn't really look like space though, does it? Doesn't remind you of space at all. What up, Valise? How are you doing? Thanks for joining.
Yeah, I don't like it. This is just a generic looking stone. I'm a little disappointed. I'm doing well. All right. All right, file, new. I'm not saving this. I'm not saving it. It's just, it's just a generic stone. Yeah, yeah, exactly. We need more swirls. So we're going to go all the way up here to 12. Boom! Boom! All right, cut. Now. Yeah, we're cranking it up to 12, guys. Now we're we're going to go we're going to get a little we're going to get a little crazy right off the bat, okay? Cut. Now we're gonna bring this down in here again. Need blue salt and pepper diamond for this. <laughs> Actually, this dark outline might... This dark outline might actually give it a little bit of pop. Do you see, you see how it gives it these black spots around the edge there? But also, it still gives us this weird, like, crisscross triangle thing going on. Let's try that out. Look at that. It's like teeth coming in. I wonder if we can do a spiral off those teeth. It's going to be hard, though. Have a good night, Automaton. Thanks for joining. I Well, we had to try it out, Metallic. It's just so... Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I understand.
All right, well, we do... <laughs> yeah, what up, Dom? How are you doing? Thanks for joining. All right, we do have to... We do have to do something on top, because if you look at it, we kind of lose that spiraliness. Oh, whoops. The girdle's a little funny. Frost P3. That kind of shows off that spiral a bit more. I think we got to do something on top. Let's see what we can do. If the girdle is too thin, then then it won't sit in jewelry or it won't get set in jewelry very easily. Man, that blue is just so intense. Let's see if we can, like, kind of dumb it down a little bit. Jesus. I like the, like, I want to get it, so if we keep it out here, we still get kind of that spirally look, right? Kind of like a portal for the space power stone. How long would it take to make that? Um, well, what are we at? We're at, like, two, four, six. Twelve times four. This would probably take a good five hours or more. However, I also really like the look of this. Right here with like the, these simple design like around the edge and then it gets more as you get toward the middle it gets more and more complicated. I kind of like that. It is a lot of facets. Whoa, look at that. That's where the that's where the three symmetry on the top here. That's insane. That's cool. Let's putz around with that. I like that.
You you would see everything. Look at that, you get kind of like three flowers. Here's the stem. Here's the little leaf. Make it red and sell it to YouTubers for the play button. <laughs> Use of broom force has been authorized if he gets too rowdy. <laughs> Have a good night, Yar. Thanks, dude. That's crazy. I mean, I don't think space when I see it, but it's really cool. For for the for the space power stone. I mean, you have that spiral still in the center. Yeah, let's see what it looks like when we remove that. Ooh. Look at all that darkness we get. Let's put that back. Guys, I have to pee really bad. I've drank a lot of tea. In the meantime, I'll be right back. I gotta pee.
It does look really pretty, and that's a really nice cut. Because you see this orange line? We want that to be low for as long as possible. All right, we're going to save it. I'm saving it. File, save. Um, this is going to be the uh, space stone. Saved. Should we see what it looks like in Emerald? How about Tanzanite? Ooh! Look at that Tanzanite. That's a nice Tanzanite cut right there. What do you think of that, Sibis? Ooh, that's a nice looking one, dude. It's not a sand dollar, but I still love it. Yeah. That's a nice looking tanzanite. Holy crap. Ooh, it's a nice garnet too. Look at that garnet. It's so blue, I have to avert my eyes. Oh my gosh. That's a nice looking sapphire. There's a ruby. Where do I buy my equipment? You kind of wore out one of your wheels. Um, which, what kind of wheel, I guess, are you looking for? Um, there, I get my stuff, um, oh, what's it called? It's like a lapidary supplies or something like that, I think is what it's called. Is where I get my cutting wheels. Um, I get my actual polishing wheels from, uh, Gear Loose. It is beautiful as a sapphire. What does it look like as a diamond? That's a really nice looking diamond. I mean, you get a little bit of windowing on the edges, but that's a nice looking diamond. Yeah, here's a ruby. Um, all right. Uh, scientific poet. What kind of, uh, what kind of laps are you looking for? Polishing ones or, um, cutting ones? Hey, what up, Paige? How are you doing? Tonight we are designing gemstones that are based on, um, the infinity stones. So, so far we've made the, this is the space stone. So if you take a look here. The, the, the space stone. I think it's called a 3000 grit diamond dusted graining wheel. Okay. Um, what I use, I, I get the solid steel ones. Um, yes, you did Paige. We've already finished three. This is our third one. Um, I get the solid steel ones, and um, there's a place you can go. I think it's called Lapidary Supply. Um, Lapidary Mart, I think is what it might be called. I haven't bought my I haven't bought new discs that are solid in in a while. I actually I bought some, but they had laminate on them, and so I returned them because I thought they were solid. Yeah, Paige, you want to see? So far, oh, we better save file. See, the thing is, is I bought I bought it used, so I don't know who uh, it's from, and it's so worn. Look, look, my wheels are so worn, it doesn't even, like, say who it is. Is steel better? Yes. Um, 
I well, okay, so I like it better simply because I get more it's more solid. Um it's not gonna warp, it's not gonna it's not gonna come off. I've had these and they still cut, and I still cut with them for ten years. I've had these. So and I haven't replaced them yet or had them resurfaced. What up, racing kid? So they are worth the investment. How you doing tonight, racing kid? Thanks for joining. Okay, so tonight we are yeah, ten years. We are uh, designing the Infinity Stones. Uh, this is we just finished this one. This is this is the Space Stone. Uh, let's see. Oh, whoops. Um, we did uh, the Time Stone. Here's Doctor Strange's Time Stone. Um, and then we did, we did the Power Stone. Yeah. And now we just finished the, um, the, uh, um, 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 Space Stone. What time is it? Nine. Okay, we got time for one more. Uh, let's see here. Where's my... There it is. Here's my picture. Alright, guys. We got time for one more. Which one? We've got mind, reality, or soul. Which one do... Which one should we design, uh, last tonight? Soul, reality, reality, soul. Hey, Belize, could you toss a poll up real quick? Let's let's put let's put a poll up there. Now I want you guys I want you guys to think of the shape that this would be. Also, thanks, Belize. Think of the shape that 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 stone would be in. Right. So, like for example. For for the power stone, I chose um, I chose a triangle because a triangle is a very powerful shape, right? It can hold so much weight um, and stuff like that. So um, that's why I chose a triangle. But I wanted to make it look a little like kind of warped, right? Because it's an infinity stone. It's pretty cool. It's pretty uh, uh, crazy. Um, and then obviously like like the uh, the time stone um, is is an eye right we imagine it as an eye so so yeah by the way Valise is the pull up I can't I don't know if I can see it or not. So yeah, if we were to do the the mind stone or the reality stone, space should be hexagon like shape. Why is that? Because six is the most versatile number. Ah, maybe the soul stone. Wait, wait. Should the soul stone have forty two sides? Because it's the meaning that that's the meaning of life. No worries, Valise. Oh my god, that would be insane. 42. I don't think I'd ever pass at that. The reality stone would be a square or a rectangle. Yeah, exactly, Simmons, right? <laughs> Meaning of life, but you got to kill someone to get it. Dude. Oh! Alice, that's that's brilliant. Do 42 facets, not 42 sided. Yeah. That's, a, that's really smart. I like that.
Look at that top. That top's just so crazy. Mine should be out of the box. Oh, that's a nice cut, man. That that looks so good. All right. Yeah, which stone should should we do, guys? Soul, reality, or the mind? Yes. Uh, open up the chat window if you're watching me in full screen and you can vote on the poll. Valise, you're fired. <laughs> Well, it looks like the Soul Stone's gonna win. It's almost unanimous. Ooh, someone chose Reality Stone! Alright, I'll give it like uh, 10 more seconds. 10 more seconds, get that Reality in there! Did you say Rebel? The Empire does not like rebels. By the way, I've shown you guys my uh, my Empire Signet one, right? Look at that. Isn't that cool? Oh, wait. You can't see it. Sorry. This is the uh, um, uh, Star Wars Empire uh, emblem. The reality is that the soul is stronger. Oh, man. All right, we're going to do the soul stone. Oh, you haven't seen this one? Yeah, I faceted this one. It's on my Instagram. Um, and uh, it looks it looks just like this. It's so cool looking. I, it turned out so good. Okay. Uh, file new. All right. All right. So we're doing, uh, we're doing the soul stone, right guys? Okay. So what shape did we say the soul stone was going to be? Cause we're going to do, um, we're going to do uh, 49 facets on the soul stone because it's the meaning of life. But what shape should it be? Many sides. Maybe... How about we do six? We can do six sides. Let's do it. Diamond? I don't think I'm gonna make it in diamond. Cause I don't I don't fast a diamond, so if we make it look good in diamond, it might not look good in a gemstone. Yeah, citrine. That's what we're that's what we're doing it in. All right, guys, I need you to keep track of the number of facets we're at. We're at one. So we're doing forty-two facets, right? It's forty-two. Yeah. One, two, three, four, five, six. Okay, so we're at twelve at the moment. Like a diamond shape, too long. Oh, 
I got you. Okay. All right, new. Let's get our citrine out here. Okay. So, we got to come up here to 48. Talking like this. Okay. I like this. I like this. So what we need is we, we need this to kind of end in the middle of the stone. Okay. Okay, so that is 96, okay. You've only seen finished ones because both times I've come in a little late. So it's cool to see how the program actually works. Yeah, Paige. All right, so this is story of a girl. Cried a river and drowned the whole world. Though she looks so sad, photographs actually love it when she smiles. So I'm making this intentionally not look like 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 sparkly yet like this because uh, I want to see what we can do on top to bring out the sparkle because I always whenever I do designs on quartz I always stick around the same angles on the pavilion and, and I feel like that really limits me so I want to try this out. No, that's not going to add anything. Um, Alright, so let's go to the crown.
Yeah, well, thank you so much, Sibis. Oh, I forgot to message you, by the way. I gotta remember to do that. All right, 3858. <clears throat> Ooh. Look at that. Okay, that's kind of cool. So far, my week's good. I get the weekend off, and the week's already, what, I got two more days of work? So I'm doing well. I'm having fun. Get to hang out with you guys. So yes, it is an absolutely fantastic week. Your week's been pretty good. That's good to hear. What makes... There's a question. What makes a week good for you? Are you going to cut these on stream? Uh, hopefully. I've got a lot of designs that I'd like to... Oh my god, look at that. So this is a soul stone, right? So it requires death to get, right? A sacrifice. This is pretty... This is pretty... You have two more hours of work, and the coffee from an hour ago is not helping. I want to curl up and sleep. Oh, we can't see it because of the... Oh, whoops. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Let me, let me get rid of that. Okay, check it out. It's got some windowing here, here, here. A little bit here and here that I'd like to get rid of. All right, Paige. But anyway, yeah, what makes what makes like a week a good week? Like, I guess for me it's it's Oh. I dig that. Um, for me, what, what makes a good week for me? Um, I think a lot in terms of feelings. So I think back to like, how did I feel all week? And stuff like that. And, uh, and like, if I recall mostly being, there's our table. Look at that table, Sibis. <laughs> um... But I think back to like, well, was I, was I, oh, look at that windowing. Was I really like happy this week? Did I have a lot of fun? And that's kind of what determines if I had a good week or not. Oh, pardon me. Okay, how do we get rid of this? I 
I'm sorry, Alan. I'm so sorry. Um, I would like to cut them, yes. However, um, I have a lot of designs that I have not gotten around to, um, cutting yet. So, yes, I do intend to cut it at some point. Right now, we are trying to adjust this facet so we don't have so much of a window right here. Actually, you know what? Cut. Let's go to the crown. Yeah, yeah, yeah! Let's do it! You ready, Alice? <laughs> yeah! Let's do it. Okay, so we're gonna go ahead and delete this. Uh, we're gonna come in here, and I think what I'm gonna do gosh. I, I just love how that looks how it is Look at that I like this a lot I mean, the graph for this is not going to be very good, I don't think. Ooh, look at that. I wonder, okay. You're glad it's not getting a heart shape? I'm wondering if I can add a little something to this here. Cause like this Okay, I guess there's just a window down there with this facet. An angled table? Yeah, that's what I was going to try and do here, actually. Um... Oh, how many facets are we at? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 22. 22. We need 20 more facets.
Kind of like that. It is almost bird-like. Step the bottom? I mean, these facets right here are what's windowing us up here. Which I'd like to fix. We could just take them out. That fixes the problem! I'm like a bird and fly away. We do my infamous 73 degrees. Frost them better than a window. Or I could just drop them down to 73 degrees, then we have a much better gemstone. I mean, photons, I, did I just sing your theme song? I'm like a bird, wanna fly away. Oh yeah, uh, so we're doing the soul stone. We're gonna try and put 42 um, facets on it. No, that'll just take away. Yeah, we are kind of short. 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18. We're at 23 now. Hey, buddy. Don't worry, I'm almost done. I'm almost done, sir. I know. Hold on, and then you can go. Oh, guys, we got like six inches of snow today. It was uh, a lot of fun. Oh, okay, okay, okay. Backyard. I'll be right back, guys. Hold on. Hold on, I gotta give them something to look at. I got. Hold on. I said. Oh my gosh. Is it. This one? Yeah, okay. Oh, yeah, I'll be right back. Oh, man. Well, guys, I think this is our soul stone. I think this actually looks really nice. It's a really fun shape. Ah! Shape, too. I'm in Minnesota. Plus seven for the girdle. Thank you. Thanks, Sibis. All right, guys, we're going to go ahead and save this now. Save. Soul. Stone. Infinity. So I don't mix it up with my soul stone from... Or, no, no, I guess it's not a soul stone in Pokemon, is it? It's a soul badge in Pokemon. What was this one? Oh yeah. 
forgot about that one. That one's really cool. It's five degrees Celsius here. You don't know Fahrenheit. <laughs> I'm sorry, Alice. All right, guys. So what, I'm going to go through uh, one more time what we made tonight, and then we're going to call it a night. Um, so tonight we we made um, gemstones based on um, the soul stones or the infinity stones, right? So we have the time infinity or power stone. This is the one that Doctor Strange has, right? And it's in, um... Oh, uh, where, where are you at? Where are you at? Right there. Okay. Right? I hate heat as well. Um, and then what we did was... We did the Power Stone... Look at that power. So I really like this cut a lot. I actually, I want to try this out. And then we have the Space Stone, which is one of the uh, better cuts that I've done. And then we've got our final one, the Soul Stone that we just did. Which is very clean looking, actually. I like that a lot. Let me uh, let me check on my dog real quick. Actually, no, because we're going to be ending here shortly. All right, guys. So other than that, um, I want to thank you so much for all of your support today with the hype train. Congratulations to our winner, Photons. Um, and um, if you enjoyed yourself, consider pressing that follow button. Um, I'd love to see you back here. Uh, you are more than welcome to join our Discord as well. Discord. Um, join our Discord. I also do commissions. I do gem cutting. Uh, which, by the way, tomorrow night we will be faceting. Um, probably finishing up this um, um, Alexandrite. Which is in the shape of a Triforce. Um, so, uh, well, thanks, Paige. I'm really glad you brought it up too, dude. By the way, tonight's stones are brought to you by Paige. Um, so thank you again so much for all of your support. Let's see if we have someone that we can raid real quick. And, uh, yeah. Is Loops online? No. What's sh what's Shobu doing? Oh, Shobu's playing a video game. I wanna I wanna raid someone that is uh, doing something else. Uh, give me someone. Chimera QC. Let's see what they're doing. What is Chimera doing? Ooh, this looks fun. Ha, <laughs> this looks adorable. All right, we're going to go check this out. All right, guys. I want to thank everyone again so much for your support. I really appreciate it. Um, be peaceful to one another. And try to use less plastic. Save the earth. All right. I'll see you tomorrow night. Thank you. It is my pleasure. Thank you, Valise, for your support. And everyone else. Okay. Let's go. Let's get it. Let's get hype. Let's show. Let's show her. Uh, she. She's never seen me, I don't think, ever. Let's show her what the rough crowd is all about. All right. I'm going to go grab my dog real quick. So answer her questions for me. All right. Let's go. Bye.